Today we're going to be talking about the Bumble and Bumble Classics line of shampoos and conditioners. So that would be this seaweed, Gentle and Super Rich, and then Creme de Coco. So these guys are cult classics. They've been around for 25 plus years. Um, these are back bar staples. Um, they're really fabulous shampoos and conditioners that um, are at a really great price point too. So yes, technology has changed over the past 25 years. That being said, these are still fabulous color safe shampoos, conditioners, but I do always like to get on my sulfate soap box when talking about these guys. Yes, they do have sulfates. Sulfates are what make products bubble. Um, the sulfates within these products are very gentle and are color safe because not all sulfates are created equal. So sulfates in something like your Dawn dish soap or your laundry detergent are totally different than the sulfates that you might find in say drugstore brand shampoos and conditioners. The bubbling sulfates that you might find in those drugstore shampoos and conditioners are going to be a different level than the ones that you find in a salon grade shampoo and conditioner. So it just gives you that classic shampoo cleanse feeling and frankly I think it's good to shampoo with bubbles every so often because otherwise you're not really getting your hair clean. The only thing that can take out products that have silicones in it is going to be those sulfates and that's why clarifying or using something like these guys in your regular shampoo and conditioning routine is important. These might not be the main shampoos and conditioners you use, but um, definitely throw them in the mix every so often because you're gonna get a lot of buildup if you don't use a shampoo with something that really cleanses your hair every so often. So that is my soapbox. Um, and like I said, yes, these are color safe. These are back bar shampoos and conditioners. They were for years and years, and obviously technology has changed. Um, so I'm gonna tell you about these products and really who they're going to be for. That being said, if you have somebody who has a fashion color, a purple hair, a red hair, or hair that's prone to fadage, there are better options. But people with, I guess, classic hair type colors, um, these guys are going to be totally, totally fine. So the seaweed shampoo and conditioner is going to be our most mild and gentle cleanse. So it is technically the lowest moisture out of the three. So this is going to be great for people who tend oily people who might be teens or kids or guys. This is a really great combination. It's very, very mild. It's not stripping. A lot of times people with oily hair think they need to use something that's very aggressive, almost like a clarifying shampoo and conditioner. But as we talked about in the Sunday video, too much of a good thing is not good and it can create, it can cause your scalp to hyperproduce oil. So this is just a really nice, mild, gentle cleanse that still gives you moisture, but it's not going to be too much. The next step up is going to be gentle and super rich. So gentle and super rich, I feel like is a bit of a misnomer. It really should be called gentle and gentle. And like I said, it's a next step up from moisture. This would have been my shampoo and conditioner option if say hairdressers invisible oil didn't exist. So this is great for your everyday washers. It's great for people who might trend a little bit dry, um, but it is very much so it should be called gentle and gentle so don't let super rich fool you um, it's a really nice gentle shampoo and conditioner so say your gym goers who have to wash their hair every day this would be the product that i would recommend the next step up in moisture is going to be creme de coco so this is the most moisturizing out of the shampoos and conditioners within the classic line um, I really think technically the only thing that's more moisturizing this is our curl shampoo and conditioner. So way back when these were the only three shampoos and conditioners we had, this was actually our curl shampoo and conditioner. So it is butter-based moisture. This product is going to add weight and heaviness to the hair. So this is not for me. This is going to weigh my hair down. But for the people who do need some weight in their hair, this is a fabulous option. Um, remember, butter-based moisture, it's heavy. It smells like a beautiful tropical beach vacation. But if you have finer hair, it is not for you. It is for your thicker, coarser, frizzier hair types that need a little bit of weight. All right, so that is my classic shampoo and conditioners. Um, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments. Thank you so much.